Hello everybody, it's Mindy. And yep, it's another Dreamers Designs. Okay, I'm gonna show you what it is. I, I had to, I just absolutely had to. And I've said it before that I really need to work on one um, so I know what the quality of these are like. Well, I think this is the one. <laughs> All right, I've asked a couple people and they had some opinions, but then this one came out and I was like, Yes, I think this is the one I'm going to do. Um, I'm going to kit it up. Last time I just destroyed the box trying to, well, now I'm going to lose my X-Acto knife in there. They don't like to come out, these little tabs here. Okay, come on. There we go. That one's coming out. Okay, cool. Um, I believe this is the one. This always falls apart. I don't know why. Anybody know why? Because <laughs> it's a cardboard box. That's why. Jeez. So, yeah. I think this is the one I'm going to kit up. Even though I probably won't get to work on it a whole lot, um, I'll get to work on it, you know, a little bit here and there. Just to get a sense of what it's like. Here's their bag. And then comes all packaged up in this bag. We'll get it out so we can see it. Here's the tool kit. Here's the drills. Well, some of the drills. The canvas. Wrapped up with a nice purple bow. There's more drills. Okay, I think we got it all out. All right, let's set this aside for later. Put it all back away. Okay. If you've never seen a Dreamer Designs, here is their uh, tool kit. It's in this very nice, very, very soft bag. And it's tied up here with a little satin tie here. <clears throat> you know, everything's just a little struggle to get into. You just gotta, that's part of the fun of it, right? <laughs> All right, sharp pointy tweezers that say Dreamer Designs on them. Two sparkly pens, one with the plastic tip and one with the regular uh, brass tip there. Okay, what else do we get? Two trays, and they do both say Dreamer Designs. Two squishies, two pots of wax. Everything is branded with their name, okay? Here is a multi-placer, a straightener. There might be one more in here. Maybe that's it. Nope, there it is. One more multi-placer. I thought there was another one. Okay. Let's put it all back in the baggie. Baggie, it's not a baggie, but you know what I mean. The nice, plush, soft bag. <laughs> all right, okay, that's their toolkit. It's the same, every toolkit is the same for every painting, it doesn't matter. All right, here's our drills, two bags of them. We'll look at those later. And got this nice ribbon, holding it all together. I put the ribbon back on when I put it back in the box. Yeah, so I get a nice experience when I open it up again. They have, I, I call it this nylon type canvas with the scalloped and, and poked edges. <laughs> Still trying to decide what we call this. I've been informed it's not surged because, you know, there's no sewing. So scalloped and hold. <laughs> um, this is kind of a stiffer type canvas. Um, it always wants to fight me when I try to roll it backwards just so I can get it to lay flat for you. It's poured glue. I'm not going to <clears throat> damage it in any way. So here comes our stickers for our colors. Here's an information sheet. Like I said it last time, they could do away with this foam roller and you know, it's not necessary with the poured glue. Nice, nice idea, but it just makes everything all tight and, you know, wound up tighter than a drum in here. Okay. All right. So this is an instruction sheet, tips, some tricks, social media, instructions, all kinds of stuff on there. Okay. And here is the sticker sheet with your symbols. You're going to just sit here. You're going to unfurl there it unfurled there you go um whew, long one right how many colors Ooh, 66 colors it's got a ton of colors 
A, B is at the bottom. One, two, and three of them. Yep, eight, 37, and 38, whatever those are. But here's our symbols. We get symbols, numbers, letters, you name it. For 66 colors, there's just no telling, right? Okay, this is what I do with this when I put this away. I just take it and I fold it backwards like this, okay? These will cut off here, they're stickers, so you just cut them apart, put them in your containers. So I fold it backwards like this and I put it right in my drills. When I put my drills away, um, makes it nice and flat. By the time I get it back out, all that stuff. Because, I mean, look at what, whang! <laughs> That's what it wants to do right now. <laughs> okay, I'll set you over there. All right, you ready to see what I got? And the one that I think is tempting me to kit it up. Here's our drill field over here. Uh, social media details at the top. All 66 colors, they're branded again. Okay, lots of prettiness, right? Look at the pretty trees. Look at all these flowers, a lot of green, but look at the pretty pink trees, purples. Okay, look, isn't it gorgeous? It's gorgeous, right? It's beautiful. Let me zoom you out a little bit. Oh, yeah. So we have more flowers, nice big tree over here, and we have the mill. This is called Summertime Mill. This is legally licensed Abraham Hunter. It's 80 by 60 centimeters, which works out to 31.5 by 23.6 inches. It's a nice size. We got ducks, look. We got two ducks in the water. We got a duck sitting over here on the rock. The water's coming down the river. It's going through the mill, spinning the, the wheel, creating some sort of power. That's what water wheels do, right? They use the force of the water to create energy, power. And the water just keeps then tumbling down the falls and the ducks are just having a good old time swimming down there in the water. Isn't it pretty though? I mean, I know it's very summery, springy, and we're going into fall and winter, but mm, does that matter? I don't know. A couple of my friends said I should do one of the fall paintings and I was like eh, it's pretty but this one came out and I was like this one kind of snagged my heart you know I love it there's a place we go in Tennessee it's called the country mill it's a restaurant now but they actually have it's a huge huge water wheel um, and the river comes through there um, it doesn't create power for them anymore but it just you know it is there and it does work. The water wheel will turn and things like that. And it's just reminiscent of a, a simpler time in life, you know, and I love it. It's so pretty. Um, yeah. So they've got a thicker plastic, which I really appreciate. A sticky canvas. Um, what else can I say about the picture? I just love all the color. Red, pink, orange, flowers. We'll look at the drills. We'll figure out where the ABs go. Isn't it beautiful? It's just beautiful. Um, so I think I think this is the one, folks. I think this is the one that I kit up. I'm trying to look at the bottom of the box and see if there's any little details I've missed about the painting. Um, I don't think so. I mean, except that you know, there's mountains in the back and the sky, and super pretty. Oh, we got this path this path that comes up here to the stairs to get in and you got to get there somehow right <laughs> so there it is isn't it gorgeous i mean it really is gorgeous um let's look up really close at some symbols with the drill field i gotta work with my camera here for a second all right you ready just trying to check and make sure everything is legible it's not blurry, not confusing, easy to read, right? So far, so good. I don't see anything causing me any issues or problems. 
Mm, it looks really good. Um, let's look at let's look at the dark area with the rocks. Can I do that? Can I do this? Yes, yes, I can do this. Again, everything looks clear. Look at all those O's. I already know that those O's are an AB. <laughs> yep, yeah, that's gotta be a white AB, all those O's, and they are everywhere. They're all throughout this water, here in the water, up here in the water, and then in these flowers, in the flowers, flowers, little dots of white all over the place, in the windows. I know we're not to the ABs yet, but the whites are just popping out everywhere. Look at all of this. It's not all the white AB, it's mixed with twos, but there's a lot of white AB in there, right? There's a lot. And then the E, you see all the E's? The E's are a green AB. Lots and lots of AB in those trees. While we're here, S's, S's are the other AB. I think that's going to be a yellow color. So that's just some of the AB, but there's a lot of it. There's a lot. And there are more white ABs in here. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, let me know. This one or fall? What is the fall one I have? Like a farm, I think it's a farm. Um, I think that one's Dominic Davison. This one's Abraham Hunter. You can put your, your vote below if you'd like. <laughs> I mean, I'm probably still going to do what I want to do, but you know. <laughs> I don't know. I've got so many other fall things to do. It'd be nice to just work on something bright and cheery. Don't you think? Look at all the pretty greens. Dark greens. Okay, I just see flowers, right? Flowers, flowers. One more flowers. More flowers. Hey, there's our friend, 3371. He's just everywhere. I haven't found a landscape painting yet that didn't have 3371 in it. <laughs> or some form of gray, like 413, 414, something like that, right? Or, or 317. There, we'll go with 317. <laughs> There's our 413 though. <laughs> lots of it, and 414. So lots of grays. I mean, that water is probably going to have several grays in it. And of course, that top of the house there, the building, the roof, more green. Lots and lots of green in this one. And we got shades of green over here, different shades of green over there. Yeah, lots of green. Okay, let's move all these out of the way. <clears throat> and we'll look at the second bag. I actually cleaned out storage containers the other day. Mm-hmm. I put two paintings worth of drills away. I felt accomplished after that. You know what it's like putting drills away? Okay. More beautiful colors. Couple bags of black. Red. And then look at all of these pretty blues. At 161, 160, 159. And 158 are all blue. Then we go to a purple. <laughs> all right. Let's see what we have here. Purple. Orange. Green. <laughs> more grays. More grays. And more blue. We must be getting to the ABs. Yeah, they're over there. <laughs> Last one. Pink. 
pink, 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 purple, purple. I just love these colors. And then this strip has our A beads. You ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Okay. Here's the white. A great big old bag of white. Like I said, they're everywhere. We already looked for them. Those are AB Aurora Borealis. Um, they have an iridescent coating on them. Picks up, I'm seeing pink, purple, a little bit of yellow. Picks up all the colors. So pretty. Then we have a very pretty pale yellow AB. And then we have this green, like chartreuse AB. So those are our three ABs right there. Nice. Okay. I, we, we found a whole bunch of them. What I didn't find a lot of yet was the yellow, which is the S. Um, so I'm gonna mainly look for that because we found most of the white. There's a little bit of S through the trees right in here, like, um, making light shine on the tree from this direction. You know what I mean? So you get a little sunshine right on the edge of these trees here. Um, there's some up in the clouds. Again, around this tree, we've got the yellow, the S's. And mm -hmm, I think that's it. We already, we already found them over here. Again, like haloing the trees, you know? And then that green is E, and it's all through here. That bright green and white is in there. And let's see, do we have E's over here? Yes, absolutely. A whole bunch of them here. That bright green up in here, here, here. You can, you can see that green. That green just pops right out. So we've got A, B pretty much everywhere on this canvas. Mm -hmm. There's some here, some here. I'm here. And that's what I love. When the ABs are spread throughout, um, it just makes it so, so pretty. So it's either this one or the fall. Um, I'm really thinking it's this one. It looks really good. And I want to try one. If I, if I even just get a corner done, you know, I'd be happy. If I can get a corner done and kind of have a good sense of what the dreamer designs are like, what they look like, how they work up, how I feel about it. It's time. It's time to do that. I mean, I have all kinds of events coming up through the rest of the year, but if I just peck away at this a little bit every now and then, um, give me a sense of how it's going. Yeah, that's the plan. Okay. I'm going to clean this up, put it away, say goodbye to my little ducky friends. Uh, just in case you didn't know, I mean, there's two boys and one girl. Two boys and one girl. Mm -hmm. <laughs> in our world, that's not a good thing. More boys is, is not a good thing. <laughs> but I don't know. Anyhow, it's so pretty. They've done a really nice job. I like the coloration of this one. It doesn't, and it, nothing looks too bright. So I just need to do it. All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. I know I'm kind of like, lol today i'm not it's not that i'm low energy i'm just quiet it's a very quiet peaceful day here today i'm just trying to stay that way quiet and peaceful <laughs> so thanks for watching hit the like button subscribe if you're new here and you liked what you see subscribe and come back more often see more things because i you know i'm always doing something and i hope you enjoyed it and stay tuned for um, some progress on a dreamer's design, okay? All right, I will talk to everybody soon. I hope you have a great day. Enjoy the video, just, you know, 